Just a comment from the post the other day about how seed oils are not actually going to kill you. I've not replied to the actual comment because I don't want you to go in there and flame this person. But there's a couple of things in this reply that are used in the wellness industry to convince you of what someone is saying. First one is using personal experience as evidence. You see this all the time. Someone will say they started a business because they had psoriasis, for example, and this was the only thing that cured it. But that means absolutely nothing because someone else's personal experiences does not translate to what won't happen to you. It does not translate to what actually happened. It doesn't consider all the variables. There's no control. It's not evidence for anything. The next is this appeal to nature. It's called the appeal to nature fallacy. And again, it sounds really plausible on the face of it, right? We are natural creatures. So anything that is natural would probably be better for us than something made in a lab by an evil cackling scientist. Except if you think about it for just a moment, this falls apart. My favorite example is this thing from Australia, which is called the suicide bush or the gimpy gimpy because it makes you want to yourself because the pain is that bad. 100% natural, 100% wants to do you harm. Uranium, arsenic, box jellyfish. Just because something is naturally occurring does not mean it is good for you. And finally, there is this, which is just absolute BS and yet repeated all the time. Seed oils were made to be engine lubricant. Well, not only is it not true, also again, irrelevant. What does that tell you other than it's slimy and slidey and a good lubricant. Indigenous Americans have been using sunflower oil since the 1500s. Grapeseed oil, palm oil been used for centuries and cottonseed oil was made specifically to be food. Hopefully now you've seen some of the things to look out for and you'll be able to spot it when people are using things that sound like evidence that aren't.